the deadline Been working all night Imagination fuels my creation Press on the gas, going fast Cause I'm running out of time Cities growing to the sky And I, I see those bright lights I gotta slow down Back to my Hello! Hello. <laughs> oh, is she lovely? You no arrived, no baggage. No baggage, but they, it's gonna come tonight and they're gonna see the first one. Hopefully, hopefully. <laughs> so, Eve is arriving like a uh, creation goddess, and I look like I've been dragged through a bush. <laughs> So we have arrived in our Airbnb, it's so cute. Uh, me and Eve are staying here in Dubrovnik for the next two nights and then we're moving on to Havar for four nights and then back to Dubrovnik again for one night. So yeah, we're so excited. Look, I'm gonna turn around and show you my view. This is the Airbnb, I'll link it down below, but look. Oh my God, it's so pretty. So now we're just gonna walk into Old Town. I think it's a 15 minute walk and we're gonna have dinner there. Chill out, catch up. I haven't seen Aoife in a year, so we've lots to be catching up on. So we good. So we are going snorkeling and we're doing going to the Green Caves, I think that's what it's called. Basically we're gonna go going on a boat with 20 people. We set a bit of crack, so we're gonna buy a bottle of wine now and sure we'll be friends with everyone in no time. Showered really quickly, put on some clothes for dinner, and so now we're gonna go down to the old town for the second night, of course. And we are gonna get some food. Yay, excited. We haven't eaten properly all day. About crisps and crisps. lots of wine. Oh, she was and... Dubai and she calls potatoes crisps now. <laughs> oh my god, I just didn't even realize until you picked that up. I'm not without you. You know I never will make it by <laughs> Oh, Aoife's found a wall I think we're Aoife's found a wall Gotta go guys, gotta go Photo shoot, woo! <laughs> Good morning. So me and Eve have just packed up and left our Airbnb. She is so cute. I am definitely going to link this Airbnb below, B &B, B &B below because she was just perfect, wasn't it? Oh my god, she was like the nicest lady. Because we're not getting our uh, ferry to a bar until half four, and she's like, "Yeah, no problem. Leave your bags here. Collect them later, so we can just go around and chill for the day, and then just come back and collect them." And she gave us like a little parting gift. I think it's like um, local soaps. Soap. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so nice. So nice. Honestly, everybody has been so amazing. So nice. Oh my god. Like all the taxi drivers have been so nice. The people in everybody, the, restaurant. the restaurants have been fabulous. Just walking down the street here. Look at all the roofs. Oh my god. So nice. This is our stroll down. Um, we actually got an Uber back last night though. So, um, the Ubers here Euro. are three euro. So much cheaper than the local taxis. So here. much cheaper. Well, not even like the local taxis would be a tenner, and the Uber was three. From like Old Town to where we are, which is like kind of on the about minutes? a fifteen minute. 15 so three minutes. euro for a what, fifteen minute taxi. Which is amazing. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we're now strolling down. We're gonna get some coffee, chill out for the afternoonish, and then on to Hover. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna get run down here now. On 
wanna run from my given disaster Speed away from the hole in my So hungry Yeah As where I never thought it would matter If I'm gone by now All my weakness keep on Just outside the walls of Dubrovnik, the city walls. city walls. So it's 200 kuna to go up, so 25 euro. So these walls better be pretty spectacular. And we only have what we have like two hours, which is not two hours. Um, so yeah, we're gonna come up now. Running in circles all over my mind. Staying up late because you stay hard to find. Stare at the ceiling, just passing the time. I'm hoping that you might just give me a sign. Cause I don't know what to do. I'm sitting here, just waiting, waiting. Whenever a call comes true. So, the latest update is that we even ditched the wall to do rough legs because we kept looking we down. Did about yeah, we did halfway. And then we kept looking down, we kept seeing people in these like bars off the side of the off the side of like the cliff basically. And we were like, what are we doing walking around? We need to be down in these bars. So we exited the walls, we came straight down to the bars we could see from the top and this is our situation now. So we got two glasses of wine and look at the view. So we've got some bit of techno in the background to keep us going. I'm falling inside of this place. Closing my eyes, but I still see your face. Why does it feel like so? We're just back up from the bar because we have to go get our ferry. But I just want to show you how there's no signs to get to this place because a lot of people just not a single sign in store, like no sign. Oh, I just like randomly see people. Oh, we should go down here. Suddenly, you walk through and bang, paradise. We have arrived in Habar. Um, it's amazing. This is like outside of our Airbnb. It's just incredible. I eat that halfway here with me. Um, we're gonna go get breakfast now. Um, we went out last night in video of that. We kind of arrived in late from the ferry, got ready and straight out. Uh, it was so much fun. It's a proper party island. I was down the beach this morning. It's stunning. Jesus girl, this girl's undercover. What? <laughs> She doesn't want anyone knowing who she is. Um, Yella. Yella, baby. Just for reference, this is our Airbnb. Okay? And this is where the sea is. So this is where I was this morning. I creeped down here and just went down there. Look at this. We will still be high from the sun and my counterpart is quite the same <laughs> so the walk home is about 20 minutes we just came across this trolley you're a bit slow there Sinead can you please hurry it up thank you thank you it's great having a personal assistant back on it again fully employed again So we're getting ready for night two in Habar. So I've set up my makeup station on the bed, of course. But this is our balcony. The sun's going down now, I think. I think pretty much very soon. Super nice. We will still be high when the lights out. Good morning. So we have just woke. It's around 20 to 12. It's not around 20 to 12, is it? Yeah. 20 to 12. Uh, but last night was braille. We went to Carpedium, the 
nightclub, which is just in her bar. And then that finishes at two, and then everyone leaves the nightclub, gets a boat, and goes across to the nightclub kind of on the island. It was very much like a festival on the other side. So we did, we got a speedboat across, and yeah, it was hilarious. Now, we are gonna go down to the beach for a bit and gonna have a swim to cure the souls. And then we're gonna go to Hula Hula. I feel like you can't come to a bar and don't go to Hula Hula. Everyone that I said I'm going to a bar said you need to go to Hula Hula. So yeah, that's where I'm going. It's not like a day beach party. Yeah. So now we are all ready for Hula Hula. Hula Hula is the kind of beach, beach bar club. place. So this is us here. Ignore the mess. You know how it is, holidays. So the weather is looking gorge. Let's give you another. Mmm. So yeah. Um, it's like four o'clock now, so we're gonna be there. We're gonna be there for sunset. It's gonna be super nice. So yeah, this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing my pink bikini from Pennies, of course. And I'm wearing silver hoops. And yeah, it's gonna be a fun time. Let's go! Baby, it hits so hard. Holding on to my chest. Maybe you left your mark. Reminding me to forget. Doesn't matter where you are, you can keep my regret. Baby, I got these scars. Reminding me to forget. Reminding me I got these scars to get your love. Warm. Hello. So, new day. Um, after the whole hula hula thing yesterday, me and Ethan were a bit, you could say, worse for wear Um. So, we went down to the beach today and just chilled out. We literally we swam, read, read my book. Chilled out. So now we decided no hula hula today, even though I'm, I'm a bit sad about it. I literally had the best time of my life. So if anyone's coming to Croatia, like it is just you need to go to hula hula. It was fantastic. So anyway, we are going down for a nice dinner now down to the square. It's nice sunset yet, so we're gonna catch sunset, get a few cocktails maybe, and yeah, a lot chiller. So come on away, we'll have some food. Shane, what do you think of this? No. No. So we're all ready for dinner. This is what we're wearing tonight. Kind of cash. We're both wearing pants. To be honest, our legs are just sick at the skin. But anyway, you get the gist. And uh, let's go. You know what every single human being does on holidays. So yeah, let's go. Hello, Anya. Good morning. So it's our last morning in Hubar. So we have just decided that we go for coffee. Um, we pass this place constantly on our way into town. And every time I say, "Oh, it looks super nice," so we're having our coffee here the last morning. Um, so the thing is, it's now ten o'clock. And our ferry does not leave Havar until 6. Um, so we have some time to kill. Yeah, so not complaining It's going to be a very chill yeah, day yeah. anyway. Chill. Not complaining. Last night was so nice as well. So this morning we packed all our bags, got all that done. Did you got and up at like early, yeah. You felt the usual. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is our view at the moment. Just like take it in. This one though. So Sinead's eating vegan now. Am I happy about it? 